We're now going to manually ventilate our patient using the Knox Box Nitric Delivery System. It's a three-step process. The first is your INO parts per million. We're delivering 20 parts per million. Next, I'm going to note the position of my valve, which is currently at 300. My flow meter is set at 10. Now we're utilizing a chart here at our facility that if my bag flow is set at 10 liters, to deliver 20 parts per million, my valve setting will be at 300. 10 to 6 parts per million, I'll set the valve at 100. And 5 to 1 parts per million, I'll set the valve setting at 50. I also have similar settings for bag flow rate set at 15. This is an easy fix to place on the front of the machine so that we know how many parts per million and what flow rate we'll need to bag to get the dose required. You can also go to settings and select a manual override to get your dose that way. So right now I know my dose is 20 parts per million, my valve is set at 300, and now while I'm in the 12 o'clock position with the dial here, I'm in the intelligent mode or delivery to the ventilator circuit or respiratory interface. I'm going to switch to the 3 o'clock position which will divert the nitric flow to my manual resuscitator or bag. So I'll turn the switch. I'm going to get an alarm that says manual override. My flow is now being diverted to my bag. You can close this out. The next alarm that's going to go off for you is going to be your NO delivered. As my sample line is still in my ventilator circuit, it's now going to start going down to zero. You can just hit the bell in the middle and it will silence that alarm. Then once you've completed bagging your patient, you're just going to switch from bag back up to the 12 o'clock position, intelligent mode, to divert the nitric flow back into your ventilator circuit.